Oh, I can't remember what I was supposed to say here. Oh, thank you. Ah, uh, welcome to Tech Feed. When was the last time you read a book? Now, before you answer, keep in mind ebooks don't count. I'm guessing since you're a tech savvy individual, it might have been a while since, you know, Kindles, tablets, smartphones, and the internet are readily available. Unless you're in school, then you're probably still using dusty old books. But did you know that all these e readers and articles on the web are actually making us forget rather than retain information? It's true! See, the human brain views text as part of the tangible world we live in, since, you know, it's plastered across almost every physical object we interact with. But the brain also has to learn what that text means. Otherwise, it's just a bunch of bizarre symbols. And once it learns what those symbols mean, it recognizes them as objects. Put a bunch of them together, and the brain can remember not only what the words said, but where they were written. So what does this have to do with e-readers, you're probably thinking to yourself. Well, basically, a screen can only hold so much text, but the words in a book are stuck on the page they land. You can scroll through text on a site endlessly, but if you print it, the words are never going to move around the physical space they inhabit. In other words, reading is topographic. Your brain is making a map of where the words are on the page as you read them. Need to find a specific quote? In a book, it's easier for your brain to remember that it was somewhere in chapter three on the lower left-hand side than it is is to scroll through all of chapter three on a screen until you find the exact page you were looking for. And since your brain has a harder time remembering textual topographic specifics, reading off of a monitor, it also has a harder time retaining the information you're ingesting. So basically, your brain is making a map of where it read something as you read, which in turn helps your brain contextualize the content of what you're reading, which leads you to have a better chance of remembering it. So what do you think? Do you guys have an easier time remembering things if it's printed out on paper rather than reading off of a screen? Let me know in the comments. And for more tech feed, please subscribe to the channel. For TFN, I'm Scott Bromley saying I can't remember anything I say on here after I leave the studio because I read off of a teleprompter. Oh there go the words. Now I don't know what to say. Just you and me, black box. Hi.